and the masters of the universe. I am Adam, Prince of Eternia and defender of the secrets of Castle Grayskull. This is Cringer, my fearless friend. Fabulous secret powers were revealed to me the day I held aloft my magic sword and said, By the power of Grayskull! became the mighty battle cat and I became He-Man, the most powerful man in the universe. Only three others share this secret. Our friends, the Sorceress, Man-at-Arms, and Orko. Together we defend Castle Grayskull from the evil forces of Skeletor. stopped him first don't look at me don't worry coward i have someone else in mind core the sorcerer i've heard of him he is one of the most powerful in all eternia the keeper of the crimson scourge core is a peaceful man he would never fight he man he would if i can trick him into believing he man has taken his daughter Come. We have no time to lose. Where are we going? To the Dark Lands. All right, Orko. Now. anyone do better. Thanks, Orko. But I've got to find out if I can count on my skills in the jungle. I'm thinking about going to the Darklands to see how I can get along by myself for a few days. But, Tila, it's not safe. I was only thinking about it. Here, catch! How, how would you get there? There's an underground river beneath the palace that leads to the Darklands. If I followed it... The Darklands? Father! What's this all about? Tila might go on a survival test. I thought if I spend a few days in the forest and... No, Tila. But why? It's too dangerous. Too dangerous for a captain of the guard? Too dangerous for my daughter. Please, Tila, for my sake, don't go to the Darklands. <laughs>
wave of Tila hears. Tila, I did it. What are you doing? Going to the Darklands. But you can't. You heard what your father said. You too, Orko. I'm tired of everyone else telling me what I can and can't do. Tila, we're just worried about you. Look, Orko, I don't want to hear anymore. I'm going to the Darklands, and that's final. I don't like this. I'd better follow Tila and make sure nothing happens. <laughs> here, Orko? Sing if you need any help. For the last time, I don't need anyone's help. Uh, on second thought, maybe I could use a hand. Gunny, Dila! I'll stop you, invader. You wouldn't be able to if I turned you into a tree. <laughs> you call that a tree? <laughs> Just kidding. <laughs> oh, don't worry, Tila. I'll get He Man. have you come to tell me of my daughter, woman? Not tell you. Show you. Look into my magic crystal. No! Arms, it can't be. It's true. They are your enemies. He man isn't evil. Why would he take my daughter? I have no idea. But he has done it. And you must save her. I will pay for this. I'll hunt them down and get my daughter back. <laughs> Good. I must go now. I know you will use all of your powers against He-Man! Ralph, prepare my transport! Kor! She was in the jungle. We did not know if she was friend or enemy. Why have you come here? I mean you no harm. I came to the Darklands to test my skills. Nothing more. I believe you. You may go in peace. Wait, Kor! There was another one with her who got away. He said he'd come back with He-Man. He-Man? You shall stay here. And I will be ready for He-Man when he comes. Your move, Adam. Orko, what's wrong? It's Tila! She's in the Darklands! The Darklands? She's been captured by Reptile Men! Reptile Men? I was afraid something like this would happen. By the power of Greyskull! <laughs> Ages 
years ago, the Red Scourge roared across Eternia, burning everything in sight. Finally, it was caught and imprisoned. Each generation, a wizard is chosen as Keeper of the Flame to see that the Scourge never escapes. Kor is the Keeper of the Flame now, and the Reptile Men serve him. The question is, why have they taken Tila? So this is where Tila was captured. And how did it happen, Orko? Just like that! Demon, look out! Demon, do something! We've got to find Tila! We won't have to find her. I think they'll take us right to her. have brought them. Father! Tila! He-Man, I always thought you used your powers for good. And I thought the same of you. Why have you captured us? Why have you kidnapped my daughter? It's you who have kidnapped my daughter. Don't play me for a fool. Perhaps if you threaten to harm the woman, they might tell you all they know. No, I'm sure that she had nothing to do with it. Besides, she reminds me of my own daughter. Listen to us, wizard. We don't know anything about your daughter. Liars! A woman! She showed me proof in her magic crystal. Proof in a magic crystal? What sort of conjuring is this? It has to be Evil Lynn. Of course. Or it is Evil Lynn who is your enemy, not us. You must believe us. No more of this! Where is Mira? Kor is so angry that he won't listen to reason. Then we must convince him another way. Sorry we can't stay in chat. Stop them! You fight well, He-Man. But how will you fare against your own shadow? Father! Run, Tila. Find Kor's daughter. The woman is escaping. Let her go. She's innocent of this. I've never dueled with myself before. If I can't defeat the shadow, maybe I can defeat what's causing it. Enough! If I can't make you talk, I know who can. Bet you're the Crimson Scourge, huh? Can't say I'm glad to meet you either. I like getting a tan, but this is ridiculous. Inside this prison is the Crimson Scourge and He-Man. I will release him if you tell me where you've taken my daughter. Oh, you aren't an evil man. You're just so angry you're not thinking straight. Silence! If you won't help, He-Man stays in there. I wonder how thick this wall is. Snake Mountain. If you wanted a test of your skills, Tila, this is it. Mira must be in there somewhere, and we've got to get her out. Come on! But why don't I just stay here and keep the engine running? <clears throat> well, this wall is thicker than I thought. This just isn't my day.
I see you. But not for long. <laughs> tell the truth even to save He-Man. Very well. Then prepare to join him. Fight. It was Evelyn who kidnapped me, not He-Man and Manitops. What have I done? I must free He-Man. Finally. He-Man, quick, before the Scourge escapes. <laughs> This is all my fault, He-Man. Forgive me, my anger kept me from thinking clearly. We've got to find some water to fight with. Wait a minute. There's water right under our feet. The underground river. All we have to do is try to get to it. He-Man! <laughs> This one had better do it. Now, if I can just direct the water... The scourge, it's getting weaker. It's gone. The scourge is gone. Apology. I got so mad when I thought you were trying to tell me what to do that I made a foolish decision. Yes, I too let anger affect my judgment. Thank you, Taylor, for bringing back my daughter. From now on, Cor, I think we'll both realize that there are times when we need to calm down and get some advice from the people who love us and think things through. <laughs> Close call today, and it all started when I was so anxious to do something that I didn't stop to think of the danger and wouldn't listen to anyone who tried to warn me. 
Well, we parents may not always be right, but we try, because we love our children, and we try to do what's best for them. And I'll tell you a secret. We really hate to say no to something they really want. So when we do, we usually have a pretty good reason. Try to remember that next time your mother or father says no to you.